Hey guys, Berserk here. So this video is going to be part two of my Man of Medan series. And where I ended off last video was when Conrad blew up the barbecue on the Duke of Milan. And Alex and Julia just got back from diving on the plane. So that's where I left off. So I'm just going to continue on from where I left off. So yeah, let's go. This meatball. Meatball. This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you hide the ring? A lady oh, we know where he stored that ring. Which one is, uh, you know, where the magic happens. Oh man, are we disturbing something? I should have let Conrad get his moment. Apologize for my brother. Family, I'd like to apologize for my brother acting like a horny fifth grader. Ah, it's okay. I can deal with children. Oh, Conrad. Conrad, get burned. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Wow, that was one of the most robotic lines I've heard so far in this game. Oh, hell yeah, and way to lighten the mood, Conrad. Oh, we didn't give Brad one, though. Manchurian gold. Oh, is that what we're looking for? Manchurian gold? We're gonna find the Manchurian gold. I can guarantee it. You got a fun ghost story, right? Y yeah, I heard a story. It happened right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Yes, we want to hear Brad's, uh... Ghost story. This is gonna be good. Let's hear it, Brad. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. They go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. God, Brad. He's pretty, uh... He's got a pretty wild mind there. I, I know he's, you know he said it's a true story, but there's no way that is. So, who did it? So Brad did it. She Plot twist of the century. Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees. It's his own face. Oh, what a, what a classic. And screams. Ooh. Nice one, Brad. I like that ghost story. That was a classic little twist there. Where the dead body's himself. I like it, though. You know what? I'm I'm just gonna give it to I'm just gonna give it to Brad. Pretty cool. Cool cool story, man. <laughs> he just called him Corn Dog. What are all these nicknames in this game? Bradical, Corn Dog. I mean, I like them, but whatever. All right, everything seems too good right now. Not much has happened. We're still just chilling on the boat. I have no idea how this story is gonna end up being scary, but it it, it has to eventually. At least I'm hoping it does. Oh man. Okay. Well, right on time. Three men on our boat. It's those guys on the other boat, isn't it? The people who uh, who ran into our little line, or our fishing line, or whatever the hell it was. Oh my god, they have us all captured. We're all hostages now. What do you guys want from us? Just take the boat. All right, so it looks like Conrad, Alex, and Fliss and Julie are all in here. What happened to Brad, though? Or he might actually be in here. I might have just not seen him. Nope, I don't see him yet. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll ungag uh, Alex first. He's a big, strong guy. He can probably get off mine after. There we go. Thanks for that help there. Okay, we can all talk to each other now. Let's fucking talk. Oh, man. What the hell happened to his face? Looks like he's bleeding already. Oh no. Hey, he's taking Fliss. Oh yes, you shouldn't have thrown all that money in the water and act like a complete asshole to them and maybe this would have never happened. They're probably gonna hurt us because of what Conrad did. Alright, yeah, let's untie everybody. And then let's investigate. Come on, Conrad. You can do it. No, you can't. Oh, God. Oh, yes. I'm dodging all these punches. <laughs> what the fuck was that? I'll be back for you later. Oh, my God. What are these accents that they that they have? Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. This guy has the funniest voice right here. That's what you get, Conrad. You should have been shutting your mouth. And you shouldn't have been an asshole to them. And now look what's happening. It's not all your fault, but it's semi your fault. 
Oh god. What are you doing with that knife right there? Please don't cut my boy Conrad. I, he might be an asshole sometimes, but I still like him. Slow down. Easy. Yeah, listen to him. Slow down, please. Alright, I'm not gonna make him mad. Alright, so it seems like they're not gonna hurt us. At least for now. I'm not gonna mess around with these guys, they're, or else they're gonna fuck me up. Oh god, they're gonna get caught right here, aren't they? Alright, hurry up guys, hide your shits. Oh god. Oh god, now they're taking Julia. Alright, so they can clearly see that we got untied. Nope, I have not seen Brad. I hope he's okay though. He's been my favorite character so far. Bradical is the man. Alright, we gotta be in our best behavior now. He's coming back in. Oh man, I, I just seen the curator right there through the window. That's pretty cool. We came here on a boat. Maybe we can take it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a speedboat. All right, I think Conrad can get the boat. All right, we're gonna break the window when the lightning happens. Here we go. One, two. Oh fuck. Oh, that wasn't well calculated. Uh, I'm sorry, Alex. Now it did it. Okay, that works also. Okay, here comes our hero, Conrad. He's gonna get us to the boat, or he's gonna get the boat. Oh man, I can grab the knife. I'm grabbing the knife. I'm not just gonna escape on myself, what the hell? Oh man, I, I messed up the quick time event. God, I'm such an idiot. I got him though. Drop it, Buster. Yes, drop it, Buster. It's amateur hour over here. Hey Fliss, you better shut your mouth. I'm trying to save you and you're being an asshole to me once again. Uh. Yeah, I'm taking it. I'm taking the gun. Oh man. Whoa, that was an absolute fail. Ha 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 ha. Fuck you too. Which one of you is gonna tell me about this? Manchurian gold. Manchurian gold. I fucking love this guy's accent. It's great. Alright, so we're fliss now. I think this is only our second time being here. We were only talking, because that's what we were doing. We were only talking. There is no harm in just talking. You wanna talk? Keep the volume down. So we can still talk, but just quietly. God, these quick time events are so fucking fast. They just come out of nowhere too. Almost every single time it's a quick time event, I have my hand off the controller. Oh my god, these these goddamn things are so quick. Oh yeah, I totally, I totally forgot about Brad. Now you're literally letting them know that there's somebody else down there, though. That was probably. Oh, yep, there he is. Well, sorry about that, Brad. You had a pretty good hiding spot, and we fucked it all up. Man, this weather is real rough. Oh shit! I think we finally found it. The man of Medan. Everyone's still alive. Could have been quite different. Yeah, I'm actually quite impressed with myself. I thought more people would be dead by now. Alright, so we're still all stuck on the ship as hostages. Are we all gonna go on there or something? On the Man of Medan? Looks like we are. Oh man, they're forcing us all to go onto the ship. Oh, and he's walking with no shoes on. On this rusted ass ship. Alright, so we're finally on the Man of Medan now. We've made it. I think we're a lot safer on our small little boat. Alright, who am I? I'm Conrad. Oh, s sorry, buddy. Jesus. I was just trying to see who I was. I wasn't trying to run away or anything. Alright, what's this? Uh. Oh, come on, man. Why'd you do that? I was trying to read that. And you just hit it out of my hand. I cannot believe they're all walking barefoot on this ship. That, that is actually disturbing. Ooh. Okay. So there's a dead body already right there. All the characters missed it. Oh, shit. Was that a rat jump scare? Nice. I would actually be very freaked out if I seen a rat in real life. That's actually something I hate. Like a lot of people hate spiders and other shit like that. And rats and mice are like my thing that I just hate. So they locked us in this room. Well, that was actually nice of him, though. He actually gave us the, uh, the flashlight. Alright, what's the game plan here, team? How are we gonna escape from this predicament that we're in? We're not 
exactly in the best position to be making any moves. I agree. Second We're kind of fucked in this room, aren't we? Yeah, man. This whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. Yeah, it is. And you're walking barefoot. Those meatballs are probably just looking for some get-rich-quick Manchurian gold. Which may not even exist. I mean, is Manchurian gold real? Like, is that actually a real thing? Or is it just in this game? We're not gonna do anything from in here. We need to keep looking around and try to find a way out. Aye, aye, Captain. We'll find our way out of here. Is this already a way out right here? No way. It, it was that easy. You don't really need to explore that much in this game. It's all really just sitting right in front of you. So, what's up, Brad? Oh, that, that option wasn't for Brad. It's for these small little glasses. Come on, Alex. You're a big, strong guy. You can pull that shit off. God, Brad is really sweaty already. Someone should create a distraction. This is going to be loud. Yeah, okay. Conrad, you do it. Create a distraction? I'm good at that. No, it's just barricaded. I think that's a lot better than distracting. I think this is the only smart way of doing it. Except Conrad is weak as hell. Oh, come on. Push that shit. Let's get some teamwork. There we go. See? See what we can accomplish when we're all working together. Oh man, we're all getting out. I can't believe that actually worked. Uh, hide. Oh god, run, run, Fliss, run. Fucking get up. Jesus Christ, Fliss, get up. Oh my god, I feel so bad. I didn't know it was gonna leave Fliss. I thought it meant both of us were gonna run. Not just, not just Conrad. Oh man, I probably left Fliss for death now. We have to go back for Fliss. I'm the reason she got snagged. Yep. Yeah, you are, Conrad. All you had to say is, Fliss, let's run on three. Alright, what's on this clipboard here? Wow, it's actually a lot of fucking reading. I think it's basically just rules and shit. No, no talking. <laughs> no talking, no playing of games, no smoking, no alcohol, no gambling, no breathing air, no drinking water. Basically, you basically can't do anything on this ship. Okay, I think Conrad's a little bit split up from the rest of the group now. Oh god. <laughs> uh, another rat jump scare. That one kind of got me. These jump scares are actually, they're kind of decent. I'm enjoying it. Alright, where's the rest of the group? Did they just leave me? Oh my god, did you guys see that? There was some girl back here. It was like a girl in a sailor's outfit right there in the corner. Let's see if I see it again. No, she's not there anymore. She was there a second ago though, in the corner. Oh, I guess Conrad can walk through doors. He literally just walked through the whole door. Where's the you are here arrow? That would be useful, wouldn't it? We literally have no idea where we're at. We're just looking at blueprints, basically, for the ship. Oh, man. That was an epic jump scare right there. That one really put the poo stains in the pants. Oh, man. Look out, guys. Conrad's coming right through the screen. He's coming right for you guys. Hello. What was that little noise I heard? That little whisper. That was kind of weird. Oh, is this a Mangerian gold? No. It looks like it's a rat's skull, maybe. Or something. Or maybe it's just the world's smallest dinosaur. Alright, let's head this way. Oh my god. You guys see that? That lady's back again. And it seems like she really wants a piece of Conrad. Conrad's getting laid one way or another. It might not be Fliss, but at least it's somebody. Oh man, now now Conrad's really getting up close and personal. Jesus. Okay. Wow, that was making my uh, game lag a little bit. It's making the frames go all crazy. Conrad's face is just too defined. Oh, I think they're down there. It's the uh, bad guys, obviously. They're looking for that Mangerian gold. Oh, there's the uh, there's the uh, part for the boat we need. Ooh, he looks he looks very angry. Oh, I thought he was gonna smash it for a second. That'd have been real fucked up. Yeah, let's go for it. Conrad just volunteers Brad to do it. Oh my god, Brad. Don't get yourself caught, please. You're my favorite character, I don't want you to die. Oh wow, there's Fliss. Okay. At least she's still alive. Thank god, I feel really bad for uh, leaving her on accident. Oh, can we maybe get Fliss out of here too? Come on, Fliss, we can attack him. Oh my god, god damn it. They still have Fliss. 
I thought we could maybe get him far enough away from Fliss to to give her enough time to escape. All right, so now we switch to Alex. I think I think this is a perfect stopping point right here. But yeah, this episode was pretty good. It was a lot better than the first one, I think. A lot more action. I, I really enjoyed this one a lot more than the first one because my first video or the first time I played this game, it was a lot slower. And this time it was a lot more interesting. But yeah, this is pretty much all for this video. So if you guys enjoyed, leave a rating. And uh, part three will be coming out soon probably within the next two to three days. So if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a rating and yeah, peace out everybody.